what's up welcome back to today's lunch pot I'm not at work today so I came out here in the garden I'm enjoying some of uh, Janie's amazing meatloaf got some leftovers and I'm gonna try out Kang stars star screen it's originally uh, a red pot I hear it has a uh, kind of a tropical flavor something like that but I grew the plant and uh, it came out uh, chocolate, uh, the one plant that made it out the grow room. And uh, let's see what that's like. Maybe it's an average chocolate pot with earthy tones or whatever. And let's see what it got. I showed a picture of the first one that ripened. And. Um, been looking forward to trying them so uh, let's take a look at the plant here's the plant and uh, it's looking very nice it was a bit short and bushy up to here at first and recently just shot up in the middle kind of evened out like like Kang said, these uh, kind of grow in clusters like this. So it's a uh, very cool, very cool uh, thing about this plant. Here's one ripe I had. Um, I had a few uh, ripe and lower like this. They look uh, look really cool. I like the plant structure and everything. And I forget what the crossing is on this. Uh, if you wanna if you wanna look into the crossing, join Pepper Lovers on Facebook and look around, make some friends. And these look like maybe the type of pepper that people would eat green, maybe. So, what the heck? Let's let's taste the green one along with these and uh, see what they're like. So here they are, they look, uh, they look like a tie cross maybe, or, uh, you know, Kang's, uh, some of Kang's favorite peppers, like I said, I forget what they're crossed with, uh, here's the green one, we're also going to taste that one, let's cut one open and see what, uh, what kind of seeds uh, we're talking about maybe maybe they don't have too much seeds maybe they do I don't want to bite into one they're loaded with seeds but uh, should have brought a sharper knife uh, just one split open some seeds there not not a whole lot it's not it's not full of seeds good and looks like a nice uh, walls look a little thin maybe not not terribly thin has a nice nice smell It 
doesn't smell the <clears throat> doesn't smell too fruity. Smell smells kinda like a chocolate pod maybe. And just a bit fruity. Let's uh <clears throat> I'm gonna try this half that has less less of the seeds. Looks like the seeds, uh, most of them stayed on this half. I did leave some there. So, uh, <clears throat> here we go. A nice juicy pod. It does taste like a, a chocolate pepper, but it's it's pretty pleasant. It is kind of sweet. It has a su sweetness uh, at first. Kind of a ju uh, very juicy burst at uh, first, and uh, the earthy tone uh, kind of kicks in after. But uh, it tastes very good. It has it has the earthy tones of a uh, of a uh, chocolate pepper. But <clears throat> kind of reminds me of the uh, chocolate Scotch bonnet, kind of, because it has that sweetness. But it's really not like uh, doesn't have the bitterness of a lot of chocolate pods, and. The heat level is uh, pretty comfortable. Not mad at that. Uh, I'm gonna take some seeds out of this one. Uh, let's see. This half had most of the seeds, and. As usual with my uh, lunch pod reviews, uh, comment uh, with your interest in the seeds and I will give them away. I'm not sure, uh, I think I heard other people get the chocolate ones, so uh, I'm not sure if he has a chocolate version and these might have slipped in or this was just a, a variant. Yeah, kind of a nice fruity burst, <clears throat> and uh, a bit of heat. It's like it's like a Thai pepper heat, kind of. Pretty good. That's a that's a really nice little chocolate pepper to grow. Very juicy. These types of small peppers, sometimes people like eating them green or picking them green. So, here's a green pot. Let's see. See what a green like uh, tastes like versus the chocolate. I'm not gonna cut this one. Hmm. It's 
still good. Not as, uh, it's kind of missing a little of the sweetness, but still tastes good. You can probably cook with them green, no problem. So, there it is. <clears throat> Chocolate star green pepper. One green, one ripe. Love how the plant looks. The, uh, <clears throat> the plant looks pretty awesome the way it it grows in these little clusters anywhere from three to five peppers together at a time so uh, <clears throat> thanks uh, Kangstar for sharing the seeds I will be sharing these along also with uh, uh, people who comment on the video and uh, <clears throat> Hmm. Heat's kind of climbing now. This is pretty, pretty spicy pot. And once again, check us out uh, on Facebook, uh, Pepper Lovers Group. <clears throat> There's always cool stuff going on there. We have a ton of members. It's like uh, one big family there. So. Uh, <clears throat> Thanks for watching. See you on the next today's lunch pack.